Okay, today I was going to talk about uh, one lines and how I create them. One of the reasons is I had a comment on my last video I did, well, a video a couple of videos ago, where I basically showed you to take a one line and break it up and put it, you know, on separate sheets without having to draw separate drafting views. Like, you know, the comment was, "How did you create the one line?" Well. I actually uh, I used to work for Snyder Electric. I created this app called uh, Layout Fast. Basically, I created an, uh, a one-line generator, basically. All right. And now, granted, after I left three years ago, and Snyder basically discontinued the plugin after I left. But as you can see here, I'm on the Layout Fast uh, page here. A web page they basically it looks like they are bringing it back because that was you know it, it was very helpful so basically I would generate my one lines using the app that I built for Snyder Electric Square D all right okay but in order to build a one line efficiently and this is what I'm gonna go over today you know so you know when you're building an app you know and you're trying to lay out you know all the different pieces of a one line I had to have some kind of you know system and what I did uh, to make it efficient and re be repeatable uh, what I did I basically uh, I want to turn on the reference plane here and as you can see I've got The reference plane set to work plane whatever uh, you know to one foot six grid okay and by doing that I was able to and have everything as you can see here everything's on a one foot six grid okay so let's say for example I wanted to create another uh, circuit here as you can see here I could just go over here and just go over one foot six snap on the grid I have uh, my circuit now I can then either I can come in here I got a little thing down here I could basically pick a panel board uh, create similar and I could drop that down as you can see here everything snaps okay it was a super efficient way of building a one line so let's say for example here I'll do another thing you know, we'll basically come in here and we'll add another circuit and this time what we'll do is we'll put a uh, ATS uh, automatic transfer switch and I'll put it over here and then I'll grab the generator where's the generator there it is Let's say create similar and I could snap it to there and then all I had to do now was just uh, you know draw a line basically from you know from here over and by doing it this way I was able to like I said write an application that was pretty efficient at building one lines uh, actually what I'll do here is I'll uh, I'll do a quick little video I actually created a video before I left it was a demo that I had done and so I'll let you see it right now as you can see that was you know pretty fast and the way it worked is that it used it used the systems browser uh, I don't have anything on my systems browser right here so but basically it would use the systems browser and maybe I'll do another video on how I did that exactly but basically it would take what was in the systems browser and it would actually build your one line, build your one line and uh, so it was a pretty efficient system here and uh, so I just figured hey I let everybody know like kind of how I did that and uh, and I was thinking about doing some videos of like you know what layout fast did when it was available <laughs> and maybe even like how I came about you know creating those apps a pretty interesting story I think at least some people tell me that it was interesting so uh, until next time